Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I would like to present to you a case today, tube number 29. Um, patient wish to have it removed for two purposes. One is the decay, pain, discomfort, and swollen. The other one is for auto purpose. In the future, she needs braces because her lower anterior is very crowding. The tube needs to be removed. And in this particular case, the reason I want to put this video out is because we want to talk about local infiltration for extraction versus IA in a block for uh, extraction. In this particular case, tube number 29, do you think you can take out a tube with uh, thou doing IA block? Yes, you can. In this case, I knew two carpio of septocan. I numb around the tube and I were able to get the tube out. And the way it works is you numb uh, a few spots. Number one, you numb at the start with the distal portion, bend the needle and start at the, the, at the distal, and then numb the, on the meso, and then numb on the uh, farther distal of the tube, like at the, number, the molar area. And then um, in the lingo, you do the same uh, meso, distal, and uh, apical part of the tube wait for about total time about three to five minutes and I were able to take out this tube without doing IA um, lock. Thank you for watching. Hope you, uh, this helped for some of the uh, clinician who concerned about using IA block and wait for 15-20 minutes before you get the tube out. It's it doable guys. Um, do what I tell you, you can do it. <coughs> Most of the case, uh, septocan work really well. It's the intra-osteous uh,